Hello, Divine Feminine. This is Renee, and welcome back. I've been feeling a lot of energy as far as the Divine Masculine goes. And I have a channeled message. Hey. I've been spending a lot of time thinking. I really don't know what to say. I really don't know how to go about fixing the situation with us. I'm kind of lost at the moment. I've still been doing things that I usually do. <laughs> you know I have my routines and my habits. But lately, those aren't making me happy. I feel like I've lost something within me. Like I'm just not I'm just not complete. I'm not satisfied with the way things are going. Matter of fact, I feel like it's all going to shit. And I really don't know the first thing to do to fix it. So I've been spending a lot of time alone, reading, watching movies, doing my habits, and kind of spiraling, spiraling out of control. For some reason, I feel like I'm losing control of everything that I built, everything that I accomplished feels like nothing. And I've been so stupid. I've been a real ass. But I kind of told you what to expect from me. I kind of warned you in the beginning. Because I didn't want it to end like this. I didn't want you to see me for who I really was. Because I know that's not the person that you want or deserve. Frankly, I feel like I really don't know where to start. And there's so much drama. I can't get past it. <laughs> I told you I have stalkers. And right now, They're, it seems like they're ganging up on me, making my life complete hell. But it wasn't like that 
when we were together. There was a lot of things that I hid from you. A lot of parts of my life that I tried to deny and keep hidden because I don't I don't want you to see me that way. And I think it's finally time to come clean. Tell you the real reason why I ended something <laughs> that I never wanted to end. I spent way too many times playing games with you because I took bad advice. I was told if I didn't pay attention or if I ghosted or if I just didn't talk, didn't show you how much I really cared, <laughs> that it would make you want me more. And that's what I wanted. I wanted you to want me as much as I want you. You see, I have wanted you since our first meeting. The first time I saw you, I had to have you. You were so beautiful. And I am such a shit for even listening, for even putting you through all those tests, all those games. Why would you even want me after learning the truth? And I don't want to tell you this. I don't want to come clean. But I love you. And I have to chance it. Please don't see me in a bad light. And I hope that you'll be able to forgive me for everything that I put you through. And I promise, if you give me one chance, I can make you happy. I can bring you so much happiness. The way we were in the beginning. You see me. You love me. But you also love my heart. I feel like you know me. I really feel that we were meant to be somehow, some way. <laughs> I feel like you're an angel. 
my blessing that I let slip through my fingers. Just my luck, right? But I don't want to lose you. And I don't want to have you look at me with those eyes in a way that would break my heart because I've broken yours. I hope you have it in your heart to forgive me for everything that I did. And I hope that you'll think about giving me another chance. But I understand if you don't. I love you.